My name is Eric B. Ricks, and we are at the Love Movement Mural. This particular location was chosen because it was an area that was plagued with vandalism, and the neighbors and the owner really wanted to do something about that. I really loved the size of the canvas. It kind of fit the design that I had previously, so both things came together to create something wonderful. Um, the mirror itself, the love movement, was designed. I wanted to do something that was universal, something that spoke to every demographic across the board, young, old, black, white, whatever. And um, something that could be timeless as well. And um, the symbols and the motifs that I picked to use were things that I felt that lent itself to that. Um, plus, also, plus also some of my signature motif like the butterfly which for me represents transformation the hummingbird for example is one of my totem animals it's, it's something that um, chases the sweetness in life and beauty um, the hummingbird is also the most precise of the flyers of the bird so you know as far as that I kind of like precision in my work so I kind of try to identify with that as well street art I was inspired as a young kid back home in Liberia, West Africa when I saw movies like, like um, Beat Street and um, was really inspired by what the young people were doing with spray paint and um, I really wanted to get into it and it wasn't until I came to Liberia thanks to the Civil War in my country in 92 and I was exposed firsthand to what was going on with the um, street art graffiti movement. Well, I think that graffiti art has come a long way in the sense that, you know, from way back in the day people saw it more as just, not as art, just as people tagging, destroying property. But I think that now we see the impact on the community when it can, it can be used for beautification um, instead of destroying property. So I think it has the ability to uplift people's spirits and to show them that there is something good coming out of what was once considered um, trash or garbage or destruction. So I think it just empowers people to move beyond their current situation that they find themselves in.